Welcome back. It's time for coins. So today, I wanted to show you a couple things I got for Christmas for my wife. And uh, as you know, I love UK coinage and currency. I think it's just absolutely fabulous. It's just super awesome and beautiful, beautiful money. And the, uh, you know, the, the, the bars are pretty awesome. And they just do just a fantastic job on their, their, their coins. And especially this one right here, you know, just their bullion coins are awesome. Just beautiful pieces of art. And um, so my wife picked, got me a book called The Coins of England and the United States, United Kingdom, sorry, United States, uh, <clears throat> uh, decimal issues. So this is anything from 1971 uh, to current. It's a hard hardcover book, and it has all these, all the commemorative and all the um, uh, <clears throat> regular coins, and definitive coins, that's what it is, definitive coins. Britannia. It gives you uh, kind of a price guide, and as I know with price guides, at least here in the United States, you don't usually used to go by the the prices that they are listed. So, I'm not sure if this, these are actually correct. Like the Red Book is not really correct, but it's kind of cool because it gives you the pictures of of the different uh, coins. And here, of course, you have the Shakespeare uh, two pound coins here. And it talks about it. 400th anniversary, hollow crown, gives you kind of uh, the mintages for them. So that's pretty, uh, pretty cool. And there's some interesting coins in here that I uh, hadn't seen before. I have that one right there. I don't think I've actually made a video off that one. Yeah, it's really, really cool. I have some five pound coins in here. Now these ones, these ones, I didn't even know about these, but this looks really cool. I wouldn't mind having these. The White Cliff of Dover, the Giant Causeway in um, uh, Ireland, Lake District. I don't know much about Lake District, but I've seen, I think I've seen a couple of videos of the end. It looked really, really pretty. And the Snowdonia. So that's probably up in uh, Scotland, I'm thinking. Could be wrong, but I know Scotland has more mountains than hills, and England has a little, it's a little more flat. So yeah. So I wouldn't mind uh, picking those guys up. Those guys would look pretty, pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, so I, I haven't really done a whole lot of reading this thing yet. So I'll probably get into a little bit, little bit more, and I might show you some more, uh, more stuff in this, this book. But yeah, it was definitely something uh, I really enjoy and like. Yeah, it's just, just uh, fun to have. Oh yeah, hey, look at that! There's the three gear graces. The silver, uh, I made a video on this one. This is actually what this one right here is for. So this is the silver bar that's based off of this design right here. And uh, here you have the uh, the harp of uh, Ireland. You have Britannia's shield there. This is Ir she represents Ireland, represents England. And then right here has the Scottish thistle and it represents uh, Scotland. Yeah, so it's really a pretty good, cool thing to have right there. And I believe it was the 18, early 1800s, 1830s, I think. Let's see, it should have a thing on here. Hmm. Actually, it looks like they reminted it in 2019. What's that? Yeah. Yeah, so it's pretty, uh, pretty cool. Um, I'm trying to 
like just to give you a little bit of advertisements down here. Yeah. And then she also got me uh, this. This is a little ornament. She likes to get me a little ornament every year and stuff. And uh, last year she got she got me a Let's Go Brandon uh, ornament, which I think is kind of funny. So, uh, but this one's a coin collecting. The only hobby where you can go bankrupt and still have money. She's always uh, joking around with me about about my coin collection and all. But, yeah, they have like the little Morgan dollar there. Uh, probably I think it's a wheat penny there. I can't really see it too well. But you have a Mercury dime and I forgot what, can't really see that one. And then there's a Buffalo nickel right there. All the O's are or a different uh, uh, coin. So yeah, so it was really, really cool. I'll have this, put this on my Christmas, Christmas tree. And so those are the coin cool ones that she got me. And she also gave me a Christmas card right here. And it says, Merry Christmas, Brandon. I love you so much. And I'm grateful that you always make this holiday special for us. You are my favorite gift of Hannah. So that's very, very special and I will keep that. So, yeah. so I just also want to thank my wife for these gifts and these were awesome. And uh, yeah, so I will uh, see you guys in the next video and thank you guys for watching and uh, have a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.